Welcome back once again, Spazites, and thanks for tuning into my little corner of the internet. This is Gizmo Spaz, and we are opening a couple of Munchkin bonus packs. These are 15 card expansions to go along with your original Munchkin card game. Uh, I've decided to open two different licensed packs today. We've got Penny Arcade and Munchkin the Guild. Let's go ahead and open our Penny Arcade first. Let's tear along the side here. There we go, and let's see, let's open it up. You got a little, uh, what is this, for the last decade plus, let me make sure I'm focused in here, uh, Penny Arcade has been doing a video, doing for video games what Munchkin has been doing for tabletop games. Some would say, doing two, those people are bitter, envious souls. <laughs> An alliance between our respective vast media empires is long overdue. And then there's a, uh... Just uh, the regular munchkin stuff here and a little card, but let's go ahead and check this out. But there's still no cake, and uh, I think that's a reference, yes, to uh, Portal. And there's a little blue portal up there and an orange portal down here. Play on your turn after the charity phase, discard your entire hand and then start another turn. Uh, call BS on GM. Play at any other time when you are in combat. The turn ends. All cards in play are discarded, and the next player's turn starts immediately. Uh, curse Pax Pox. Um, wow, okay. Pax Pox. Oh, it's from that, like, the Pax convention that goes around. There's a couple of them. Uh, your level does not add to your combat strength in your next combat. Uh, shouldn't have looked. Play this card when any player checks the rules. That person loses a level. Ha! <laughs> That's great. <laughs> Unholy Metamorphosis. Play during a combat where there is a helper. The helper is replaced by a new level 10 monster worth two treasures and one level with bad stuff of lose a level. The main player may ask for another helper. You killed it, you eat it. Play after any monster is killed. The player who killed it must discard one card for every treasure he got from the combat, not counting those given to a helper. Level 2 Orc Math Guard. Double the bonus of every card played to help the Math Guard in combat. That doesn't sound right. I don't know. Bad stuff. Have your level round down and discard that many cards. This is a monster card. So these, nope, those are doors as well. How many treasures are there? One, two, three, four, and I guess the rest are all doors. So a level eight laser squid nemesis. Uh, unaffected by the sword of slaying everything except squid, this should go without saying, but we know you, so we are saying it. Bad stuff, it has more hands than you. Lose all items requiring hands. Oh no. Uh, level 12 undead zombie GM. He cheats, undead. He cheats. Undead in the combat, including him, get plus five each. Any successful die roll you make in the combat or to run away must be repeated in order to count. Bad stuff, lose two levels. Yikes. Level 16, Deep Crow. A wizard who defeats the Deep Crow can keep it as a steed instead of taking two levels. As a steed, it gives plus six. That's pretty awesome. Bad stuff, you are fodder for its hideous offspring, i.e. dead. Uh, level 20, the Flesh Reaper. Defeat it by buying merch. Every 100 gold piece, pieces worth of items that you discard in combat gives a plus 2. You may discard from your hand as well. Bad stuff, your torso is collected. Discard your armor, then you are dead. And then here we are with the treasures. Dire Teddy Bear. Uh, used during any combat. Plus 5 to either side. Usable once only, but if it is used against a player, it goes into the player's hand after the combat. 1,200 gold pieces. Plus two, Hat of the Hot Stepper. This is a fire flame attack. Headgear, 400 gold pieces. Plus one bonus, Inferior Boots. Your friends won't bother to slip them from your corpse, so if you die, your new character gets to keep them. Oh, that's nifty. Uh, plus six bonus, Sinister Bow of the Black Maiden. Shoots witches instead of arrows. Also, you never run out of witches. <laughs> it's a two hands item for 900 gold pieces. That's a pretty awesome one. Let's go ahead and open our Munchkin the Guild pack. Boom. Okay. Let's see. We got one, two, three, four, 
five, six, seven, eight treasures this time in one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine doors. So, and then uh, let's see. If you like the guild, this set is for you. If you haven't seen the guild, uh, go to watchtheguild.com right now. I do highly recommend that. It is a really good show. It's very funny. Felicia Day is one of my goddesses. Uh, the guildies are munchkins. They kill foes, steal the loot, and bicker over it. In-game handouts. Sound familiar? Well, illustrations by Lynn Geekaweek uh, Peralta. These cards will put Codex and the gang on your side for the moment. Let's check it out. We got Curse. Uh, lecture your party in awkward, repetitive sentences that are filled with digressions and irrelevance. Bore every one like some repetitive, boring thing. Lose a level G. Let's see. Curse schooled. Your scary substitute just sent you out of class, so lose your class. Lose your class. G. Uh, you get two of those. Let's see. Elected guild leader. It's all your fault. Whenever anyone else wins a combat draw a face down treasure whenever anyone loses combat lose a level you may voluntarily lose a level to stop being guild leader Let's see rules are for losers play this card with an item card uh, you have in play or when you play an item card from your hand this item is legal for you to use even if otherwise even if it otherwise would not be you may shift this card to another item when you lose sell etc the the attached item but if you have no other item, you must discard it. Uh, unplugged. Play during the combat. All one-shot cards the victim has played so far in this combat are discarded and have no effect. Uh, level 10. Tall Hot Girl. Plus 5 against anyone of level 4 or below. Will not pursue anyone of level 2 or below. Bad stuff. Splatted. Lose a level. 3 treasures. Level 15. Zabu's Mom. Plus 5 against males. Bad stuff. Uh, guilted. The next time someone asks you for help, you must agree with no reward. Two levels, four treasures. Level 20, the Kevinator. Plus five against absolutely everyone. You get a problem with that. You got a problem with that. Bad stuff, deaded. Uh, not only are you dead, but you have any race or class cards, you must discard one. But if you have. Okay, and then here we are on to our treasures. Plus five to sex sexterity. You get an extra plus five in combat when you are helped by someone of the opposite sex. Keep this card in front of you until you die. Commodity exchange. Play at any time except during combat. Discard any item you have. Take from the discards any single item worth twice as much or less. And a second one of those. We got Midnight Munchkin Madness. Uh, used during any combat. Plus X to either side where X is the number of Munchkin boxes. Any type in the room with a max of 15, usable only once. Oh wow, that's interesting. So make sure you have your whole collection with you when playing that game. Uh, out of game benefits. Unless the winning level is at stake, the player you ask for help must help you without reward, usable once only. Uh, sell game t-shirts. Draw two treasures. If you play this card during a combat, you can use the new cards immediately, even if that requires replacing items you have in play. Nifty. Uh, plus three munchkin armor. I like it. Uh, pep talk from your avatar. Go up a level. Oh, cool. And that's it. That's awesome. Okay, well, that's uh, been two packs of uh, munchkin expansions, the guild, and penny arcade. Uh, I hope you enjoyed it. Please a like or comment down below. Thanks for watching, and as always, be kind, happy hunting, and goodbye. See everybody next time. Bye.